time of peace. And in South Australia, the class has made only a peaceful appearance in the post war period. Two juvenile carolongs. Mummy or daddy breaking up the biscuits. Mummy or daddy collecting the biscuits. Now, on the one hand, I may be seen as making a rod for my own back. But that's only looked at from the point of view of I'm teaching these birds to beg food from me. The way I look at it, for the last seven years, these birds have been keeping me safe from poisonous predatory snakes. So it's actually a good idea. At the moment, they've gone on a sky watch because they can hear a helicopter. And there are, well, there's a, a, a swamp harrier and a whistling kite and a wedgetail family that are all overflowing, so. Anything in the sky tends to get these a little bit twitchy. Let's see what we've got with the helicopter. Okay, I've got the helicopter in view. It's fairly quiet because it's descending, coming into Glen Innes. A three-bladed main rotor. We're looking at an aerospatial product. On long skids. I'd say a twin engine squirrel. Yes, there was something in your sky, wasn't it? There was something in your sky and it made you send your babies off and hide under the trees. But the biscuit feed still goes on, teaching the little snake guards. Warbles on a lot to YouTube. Ciao.